little YouTubers out there. Sorry you've been MIA, but my hubby got hurt at work, but he's doing a little bit better now. Um, and also, we had a yard sale scheduled for two weeks ago, but we got rained out. So our house was pretty much a storage facility we for our week. We brought everything upstairs, downstairs for the yard sale, and it got canceled, and there was just so much stuff we couldn't even film, so. Yeah. And so we were able to have one this Saturday, and it once again was an awesome turnout. Thanks everybody for coming out and purchasing our goods. Yes, and um, hopefully we get a few new subscribers. If you are new to our channel, please like and subscribe and share. It is free. And it and helps the channel out. Thank you to all of our subscribers. So on Monday we went to SCD Sales, one of our local liquidation places, and we bought two pallets, um, which came with a lot of big things. Um, that more, I can't lift. more baby gates. Um, we do have a beautiful four-in-one baby crib in white. It is beautiful. Um, we have a gaming chair that hubby put together. Um, we have some cooling beds for dogs. Um, they're pretty big. Some play yards, like gates, but that they're, um, you can make them round and the kids can play with them in the play yards. And this is some of the stuff here that we can show you. Um, we also went to another local liquidation. We found a new one, guys. It's IR Merchants, and they are located in Warwick. And we bought one pallet from him and his wife. They are great. Um, we got some awesome stuff. Uh, this is one of the things. This is a Ninja Professional Extra Large Food Processor. This is a pet-inspired bark bath dual use by Bissell. It cleans your dog and also cleans your rugs if your dog spoils on them. It is absolutely awesome. You want me to show them this one? Hubby's going to show you the, the foodie. It's nice and light so I can pick this one up. This thing's nice. I've already claimed this though. Yeah, this one isn't for sale. <laughs> it is slightly used. Slightly used. I think they might have tried it once, but... It's nice. I mean, the stickers are still on it. Yep. The box that has the attachments has never been opened. Yeah, they've never used this. They never used it. Everything's all still wrapped in there. All wrapped, brand new. That pot. It, it's nice. Um, this Bissell Bark Bath Dual Use isn't that big. It isn't that big, but show them, huh? we um, watched a YouTube video because at first we really didn't know what it was or what it did. I thought it was a steam cleaner. And um, then we read up on it and it says, bathing your dog. And then you also can clean your carpet. It's it's incredible. <laughs> I'll just show them. This is the cardboard piece that comes on the top of it. You see that? It shows all the attachments and everything. And it says for cleaning spots and stains. And also for bathing your dog. This thing is pretty awesome. Now. This is just the accessory. This is the accessories. I'll show you that, guys has all kinds of attachments very nice this thing is nice and the it, shampoo for the carpet and for your dog is in here and it even comes with this like a little that's to dry your dog it's a special mat that dries them quicker I thought they like sat on this when they were getting groomed well, that's nice. Yeah, but then you can dry them with it too. It reminds me of those, you know, those dogs with the long. And then it comes with the no rinse dog shampoo. This is a full bottle, never used. 
And then it comes with the Bissell Spot and Stain for your rugs. This is the machine. It's not that big and it's not it's heavy at all. It's not heavy because if it was, I wouldn't be able to lift it in my condition. And it has, it has two compartments, one for clean water and one for dirty water. That'd be the and dirty then water there's a... There's this that you fill with, if you're cleaning the dog, you put the shampoo in. And then if you're cleaning the rug, you put, you put the solution. rug shampoo solution in. I mean, look at that. This thing's immaculate. And here's Milo. Now I am going to disclose one thing. Even though this is brand spanking new, it does look like whoever pre-owned this this dog wasn't too happy with this attachment. So one attachment, one attachment has a little uh, has a few oh doggy bites on it. My Milo is sniffing this because he can smell the dog. Yeah, that dog chewed up that attachment a little bit, but it's still all good. You smelling doggy in there? Huh, Milo? You smell doggy? Oh. But other than that, other than that, it's like this brand is new. brand new. They probably used it once, and the dog did not care for it, so they were like... I think the price of this was over $200. Oh, I bonked him with the thing. Um, Milo. It will be listed on eBay. Milo, get off the table. You silly. Over here. Get in your spot. Thank you. It's another thing we got. I don't know which place or what place was it from. This was from IR Merchants in Warwick. This one was. Okay. This. What it is is a laser. It's a Johnson laser. Uh, I don't know. I call it a survey thing. But it's some kind of laser measurement thing there. That the tripod. You got this pot here where you somebody holds this and then you go on the other end. I forget exactly what it's called. But we have that. We have all every attachment and pieces that you need to do the uh, laser leveling. Got that pot. This is all brand new, never used. This is uh, the LED laser detector. It's part of the kit. That's brand new. And I guess this would be the most important part right here. It's all brand new in the bag. Oh, there is. It's, I thought it was just a piece of plastic. No, no, those are the safety glasses. You got safety glasses so you don't burn your retinas. got the uh the target thing but i imagine this is probably the best part of it it's the laser uh piece itself all brand new this has never been used it comes in this beautiful carrying case all brand new does that laser thing go in there yeah we'll put it in there. and if anybody purchases this locally I'm going to even throw in some safety cones. Safety first. We have plenty of them. Yep, we got safety cones. Safety on the job. Well, I guess that didn't work out for me, but that's all right. Okay. We have some Zetra blades. They're roller blades for fitness. And they're pretty cool. My love. They are brand new. <laughs> My favorite color inside. So these are the roller blades. Oh, they're brand new in plastic. They're size seven and they cost $127. But we'll probably I'll sell them for around 50. They're really nice. 
Really nice. They get the strap there. That thing in the back. Uh, I don't Velcro. know what that does. This? No, no, back there. Oh, that's the brake. I don't know. I don't. To know. slow you down. These are really nice. Tag Bring. still on. Tag still right there. Very. These are nice. I mean, I'm. I'm too old and fragile to be rolled right now. Yeah, me too. <laughs> that's a young man's game. But they're really nice. They're beautiful. I hope the camera shows uh, how nice they are. In the box. Brand new. Brand new. In the box. They're beautiful. So we still have this, which I don't know why. Maybe because we're not describing it enough, right. but this is the Gamer Republic of Gamers Gaming Monitor. It's just it's just it's a portable monitor for gamers. Yeah. For gamers. It's not the processor, it's just the monitor itself where you can connect your gaming system, system to it. You want me to take it all out and everything? Yeah. And this thing's brand, brand new, and it new. comes with a carrying case. Very nice carrying case. Very nice packaging. Look at that, guys. Very it nice. is called an ROG Stix XG16. Hmm. The ROG stands for Republic of Gaming. It's all brand new. All the stick is there. This is brand new. Still all factory packaged and sealed. And it comes with a color collaboration testing report. Has all the, uh, everything's in that. It's brand new. Never used. So we looked this up, and the price of this was $565. Um... We have it on eBay for three hundred, but we're gonna lower it to two fifty. But if anybody that's watching the video is interested, um, please contact us. It's all brand new. It comes with a bag. You know, you got your gaming system, you want to, uh, I you guess... You want to go portable? Yeah, somebody was telling us that they they carry around these in, like, those metal suitcases. And they just flip, open that and they put the screen Big in there. Big time gamers. Yeah, I don't know. I haven't played any games since the Atari 2600 back in the 1970s. Okay, we have an Omega Juicer. Um, this is not new, slightly used, but, I mean, it, I, it looks like they might have used it once, because everything is in the boxes. See, like, there's two separate boxes. No, this is too heavy for you. But it smells like oranges. <laughs> so I think they might have used it once. I mean, all the pieces there, this thing is immaculate. It is. It even comes with, with a, a cleaning brush. So. It's nice. We're not big juicer people, so. Probably will not keep this. This will no. be for sale. Guys. This will be for sale um, on eBay. Probably going to let it go for 50 bucks. Anybody inter interested in an Omega slightly used juicer? Gently used. All highway miles. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Oh, is that right? It's okay. And it will be available locally on uh, Marketplace. Mm-hmm. So if you're local to Rhode Island and you want to Get yourself a beautiful, slightly used Highway Miles only juicer. Check out the uh, email in the description. Just let me know. 
Okay, now I'm not going to take this out of the box because it is heavy. But it is a beautiful Victrola. Victrola? Here is a picture of it. Hubby can bring it up close. That I can carry. And but that's it not is. The color. It's wood. Yeah, it's a Victrola 8 in 1 Bluetooth record player, multimedia center, center, built in stereo speakers, turntable, wireless music streaming. And it is made out of mahogany, real wood mahogany. That's beautiful. I'll, I'll tip the box. Nice. Beautiful. Brand Fine. new. Brand new. Okay. Now, this next thing. Is this heavy? Uh, um, Not very heavy. This next thing was in a box. A long box, and it was really light, and I'm like, oh, what the heck can be in this box? I really didn't pay too much attention to it. It's a golf club. So I got home, and we opened the box, and it's a golf club. It's a golf club. So I was like, oh, one golf club. Really didn't think too much of it. I said, look it up. Some of them could be worth a couple of dollars. So I was going to take it out back and hit some candy with it. Thank goodness I looked it up. Because there's a barcode right here, and I looked it up, and this is a uh, King KB, KBS. Is that what it's King Mim Tor nine nine iron, iron KBS taper. KBS. Okay, Mim is to say. I'll show them. It's still all wrapped in plastic. It's all, yeah, it, it's even got, if you take that off. It's got this plastic, but the head right there, I don't know if the camera's going to pick it up. This is all still wrapped in the plastic. Brand new, all wrapped, the handle's wrapped in plastic as well. So, I looked it up, and I almost fainted, because... Luckily, you already sitting down. I was sitting. <laughs> this golf club is worth thirty. $1,500. It is on sale right on sale. now for $1,199. You can look it up. You can look it up. We gave you the description. Just look it up. King. Go to Amazon. King Cobra. I couldn't believe it. Cobra. King Cobra. I knew there was a Cobra in there. Yeah. King Cobra. To Mim Tor. Mim Tor. M I M. M I M. Taper. 120 you can look it up look it up and you can see for yourself how much it's worth and what it's on sale for on sale for a thousand dollars no a little more than that just over a thousand on sale mm. on sale but originally thirteen hundred dollars for a golf club for a golf club so i was shocked um i mean it's a nice golf club i mean i don't know i was gonna go hit cans with it thank god she no no up. So this next thing hubby cannot lift. I would, have been, I would, I would have been in Milo's doghouse had I damaged this thing. This is a safe. Um, this can this is a wall mounting safe that you can Well you can mount it you can mount it against the wall or you can mount it flat like Yeah. And it's got the push thing, but it also comes with keys, too. Two keys. It does come so with you, two keys. You can program it to an electrical code, or if you forget it, or I don't know, something happens, there's a little plastic thing. You that take comes that off, off. And you can use a key. To and it comes it. with two keys. Two keys. So, that's a safe we got. Do not lift this. No. It's safe not to lift, lift it. <laughs> Oh. We got a baby John Deere oh. wheelbarrow. <laughs> Milo, you'll fit in the wheelbarrow. Oh, it's really ages two plus. I didn't notice that before. Say it right it's there. a baby wheelbarrow. So if you want to have your little ones help you outside in the yard, there it is. It's a little baby wheelbarrow. It's cute. John Deere. Very cute. It's nice. It's heavy duty steel construction. Easy rolling wheels. It's not, not very big, but... We have a four inch egg crate infused with green tea memory foam topper for Queen. Infused with green tea? 
Yeah, that's what it says. I don't know, guys, but thanks again for tuning into our channel. Yes, thank you. It's brand new. Brand new. Brand new. There's no way you're going to roll that back up. No, it's still <laughs> in the package. It's never still been out. In the plastic. Don't try to lift it. I'm not trying to do anything. Okay. We got a few more things. Hold on. I don't know how much that's worth, but. A hundred dollars. That must be some sweet ass green tea. Ta da! A razor scooter. We got a razor scooter. And um. This one, uh, yeah, you can keep talking. I'm just trying to figure out how this one again. Um, it doesn't look used at all. Oh, that's brand new. Oh, there you go. Almost got myself. And then these handles pull out yeah, you and just, fold down. They just pop out. And oh, fold man. down. This is one sweet ride. So we have that. We look this up. It goes for $127. We're going to sell it for $60. Very nice. This thing is all aluminum. Nice TIG welding. I know. I, I just happen to notice that because I do weld. Now, I know a lot of other um, people that do unboxing, they let you know um, how much they spent on the pallet and you know the cost per item cost per item and everything like that um we don't do that i mean we pay anywhere between three and five hundred dollars for a pallet if we double our money i'm happy with that yeah. that i'm i'm happy with doubling our money um but we also take into consideration a lot of times we get stuff like pots are missing or furniture's broken or yeah 2,000 baby gates. Right. Um, even though I do have a yard sale once a month and we get rid of a lot of stuff, I give great deals. Anybody that's come to, we've had two now that has come, knows the deals that we do give. Um, I was actually outside the other day throwing something in the garbage and the guy that had come to the, to the uh, yard sale stopped and was asking if we had this, that, or the other. We let people know when they come. We have a YouTube channel, and if they see us on box or something they want, they can just email us. And, we'll... and if you are watching, you asked if we had a gaming chair. Well, my friend, we, do. we got one in a pallet yesterday. So, yes, we do have a gaming chair. So, if you... Um... Oh, my God. It's got a kickstand. Yes. And a break. Look at it. Yeah. This thing's sweet. I know. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt you. I was just shocked. I didn't know I had a little, oh, a little kickstand. That's so cute. And now we are going to bring out... This thing is awesome. <laughs> something when we opened the box, we both looked at each other like, um, what are we opening? Because we had no idea. But give us a second. We're going to get it. We'll be right back. Okay. Here it is. <laughs> Now that we know what it is. I thought it was some kind of toy you ride on. It is know. for an ATV. Or, or you, the utility uh, thing was utility trailer. What is that thing called? Utility vehicle. Got a little dump body on the back. Oh, well, ATV. You put this on the back. It's got the handles here. It's got the seat. Somebody can handle. ride on the back. But it also. I'll turn it around. Okay. It's really not that heavy. It's lightweight. And in the back here, well, this is made by Black Boar. And you can flip this up. And you have you got storage. storage. Here are the keys. Yep. And the hardware. And the to hardware. Mount to mount it. To mount it. All the instructions still wrapped in plastic. So this is an ATV Rare Lounger by Black Boar. You even got the little reflectors on the back. Um, I'm going blank on a price, but I do know that we're going to... 400 over $400. This was over 400 And that laser thing that my husband showed you, that was 500 for that. So that's being sold for 250 This is brand new. And it also has... You can lock it, and also it has these... Uh, 
pull downs like a bungee to hold it down. It's got the key, the lock right there. Can you imagine? An ATV lounger. Yeah. Put on, you mount it to the back of your ATV and people can ride in comfort. Okay, we have one more thing. This is made by Pio. And it is a karaoke. Um, what is it, babe? It's a karaoke receiver stereo. It's like a receiver, but it also does karaoke and uh, stuff like that. Brand new in the box. Brand new. This is an antenna that comes with it and the remote for the turn it this way. It looks like a like a receiver. I don't know if I can look. But it looks like a, a receiver, but it also does karaoke. Okay, so, so five five channel digital karaoke audio Bluetooth and radio receiver. So all of these things will be listed on our marketplace on eBay. Um, we do have other things that we we do have a lot of stuff. We got a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Three pallets. Uh, three pallets. It's gonna take us a little bit. Um, like I said, we have baby gates, doggy gates. Um, Cribs for the babies. We have doggy beds, cooling beds. Cooling beds, yep. These things are new. It looks like a it looks like a doggy cart. I'm gonna tell you, we do get some stuff in the pallets that I do not feel safe in selling that we do throw away. We got a dog bed. I didn't like didn't like it. You could tell it was used. Yeah. Um, my dog went right to it and peed on it because he, he knew, knew a dog was on it. So that went out in the trash. Um, we got a baby thing. It had a crack in it. I wasn't safe, didn't feel safe with selling that and letting a child use it. We threw that away. But so, it's all part of buying pallets. Some stuff's going to be damaged, broken. We've got tablets that were broken that right. went in the trash. So the, it, it comes with the business, but... You just take a chance. It's you not know, like you can go there and take everything out and say, oh yeah, all right, I'll take this one. Right. You go there, you look, you can see in there, and you take a chance. So once again, we will be putting out another video again this week. Sorry we were MIA for a little bit, but hubby needed to get better, and our house looked... Like, like a, warehouse. a warehouse that I just didn't feel comfortable doing a video in. So thanks again to all of our subscribers. And anybody else, please like and subscribe and share. Thank you for staying all the way to the end of the video. If you have any comments, just let us know. Any questions, email us. We'll get back to you. And Thank you. See you soon. See you on the next one.